Thank you, Zach. Woodsdale Elementary School is trying to get everyone on the same page as a major construction project is nearing its future. 7 News reporter Aaliyah Keller joins us live in the 7 News studio and tells us what the school is planning to do to respond to the concerns from the community. Aaliyah. Steve, it all came up during a community meeting tonight. Big renovations are coming to the school, but that's expected to take away some parking. A concern to many. Meanwhile, school officials are just beginning to come up with solutions. From expanding in the back, adding on an upgraded cafeteria, to doing a total remodeling of the classrooms, big changes are coming to Woodsdale Elementary. But there may be a few bumps along the way. I think the concerns, uh, you know, with the community, the surrounding neighborhood is going to be the parking situation, which is already a concern on a daily basis. It's certainly nothing unheard of to Principal Ashley Minch. Principal Minch says they don't have much designated parking to begin with, with 58 staff members and only 30 spots. And even more spots are expected to go once construction gets underway. We are actually about to lose 16 spots potentially on our playground for the construction work. Nothing Principal Minch and other school officials plan to ignore. So where do we put those 16 cars is the, is the common question that we're getting uh, and that is what we're working towards. We are exploring all options at this point, trust me. She's talking about options like parking at community businesses or large parking lots that are underutilized. Even a carpool idea came up. Right now, there's no clear resolution at this point, but there's one thing Principal Mitch plans to keep in mind. I think that, that safety of our students is first and foremost in our minds, and so we will continue to make sure our students are safe, and you know, a little inconvenience here and there with the construction uh, is going to be so worth it in the end when they see the beautiful project. Now, there is no set in stone timeline yet, but Principal Mitch believes construction will begin around their winter break. Live in the 7 News studio, Aaliyah Keller working for you. Thank you, Aaliyah. William e